Hello brothers and sisters in Christ. This is just going to be a quick warning vid video against a particular uh, manufacturer of hand sanitizers. Now, as you know, everywhere you go, you're supposed to put on hand sanitizer. Well, that's my understanding. I don't go to a lot of places, so I can't confirm that. But, um, let me just read this to you. All right. It says, back in stock, Medex Labs. Actually, I think that's an ad. Made in USA, yeah. If it says made in the USA, it's okay. Because this company's in Mexico. FDA issues warning over certain hand sanitizers due to potentially toxic chemicals. Now, let me reiterate that. Back in stock, Medex Labs, that product is fine. It just happens to be right above a warning against hand sanitizers. That's kind of not a good place to put that. But anyway, I wanted to make certain nobody said that I said that particular product was no good. All right. If it says made in the USA, it's all right. All right. This particular item. Now, it says the products are still available for purchase, the FDA warns. Now, the Food and Drug Administration is warning consumers not to purchase hand sanitizer manufactured from ESK, e -S -K, Biochem, capital S-A, small d-e, large c-v, sade c-v, I don't know how you would say that, due to the potential presence of toxic chemicals. Nine products manufactured by the Mexico-based company, which are still on the market, may contain methanol which can be poisonous if absorbed through the skin or ingested. I guess that'd be if you left your hand sanitized, like I've got this little cute pink bottle. I keep little bottles and one big jug and refill from that so that I've got them all over. I was doing that long before CV. Um ever was heard of unless you knew about coronavirus causing colds okay so anyway I guess if you had something like that laying around and your child got a hold of it and thought hmm wonder what this tastes like children are curious little creatures they may try to drink some anyway listen to this FDA tells hand sanitizer producers to make it unpalatable after surge in poison control calls. Now, why don't they just tell them to take it off the market? If it can be absorbed through the skin, how else are you going to use it? I mean, yeah, if a kid drank it, who else would drink it? Oh, I wonder if somebody so desperate for a drink would drink it for the alcohol content. That's just gross. Perhaps that's why they said make it unpalatable. I would just say take it off the market if it's got methanol. That's just crazy nuts to me. All right, then it shows someone using some and then it just says FDA that's a tweet advises consumers not to use any hand sanitizer manufactured by Esk Biochem due to the potential presence of methanol which can be toxic when absorbed through the skin or ingested 
and then it says this is all blue so it's a link go dot usa dot gov slash x w p p as in paul three the number three and a c is in charlie okay and then it goes on to list the names of these different products one they've listed twice but the fda said methanol should not be used in hand sanitizers due to its toxic effects and consumers who have been exposed should seek immediate medical treatment significant exposure to the chemical that means you have bought it and you're putting it on all the time significant exposure so probably if you walked into a store they had it because it was cheap and you used it one time you'd probably be okay but if you experience any of these nausea vomiting headache blurred vision you start walking through the store and your eyes are all of a sudden all out of focus you know it was the hand sanitizer permanent blindness seizures coma permanent damage to the nervous system oh my gosh or death the FDA's warning reads and they're gonna just leave it on the market are you kidding me and then there's a link that says get coronavirus fighting hand sanitizer from these unexpected brands okay I'm gonna put a link in the description box and if you can't find it and you really want to know more you let me know in the comments and I will copy and paste it to reply to you okay alright with that I'll say bye for now I'll talk to you later